Michael Starr is seven stars away from his father. His father was here in 2018, November, yeah. and he was very proud, and uh, he's, a, he's a legend. And it's timely that he passed on the week of the Oscars as well. First of all, he was 103, and he was acting since he was a kid. There aren't Hollywood legends like that anymore, in my opinion. I'm sure there will be, but right now, this was a legend to me. And I think people who want to become actors should see the work that he did. Because he was wonderful. Oh, anytime we we, um, uh, we lose a Walk of Famer, it hurts, you know? And we know it's going to happen someday, but, you know, again, another legend is gone. And uh, it, it is painful. We, I saw him a few years ago. He was one of the first to get a star on the Walk of Fame, but we didn't have ceremonies then um, in 1960. And so we got to go to his home, a few of us at the chamber, and we gave him his official Walk of Fame plaque that he never received. So that was a very cool thing for us. And he was so gracious, his wife was so gracious. It was, it was wonderful, a wonderful experience. The first time I met him when I worked as a concierge at Riviera Country Club 30 years ago. And we got him on the course, and I remember seeing his dimple. I never forgot it. Here he, he has a beard. Yeah, the last time I saw him was 10 years ago, when he was waiting for his right after he had lunch with Nancy Reagan at the grill. It's such a sad day. Uh, I take it personally because I used to see him when I worked in Beverly Hills in this outfit as well. And he was such a nice down-to-earth man. I remember so many things he would say to me in this fact is in acting wise we talk about that it's the last of a golden era this is it i mean he was the last one i mean to be 103 and he wasn't a superstar he was a legend so oscars will be in mourning kirk douglas is was our leading man we feel like he's been part of this community so long and someone we looked up to and loved and loved us back with all his participation and charitable donations and and his vitality. I, I will always think of him as funny, smiling, handsome and full of life. He reminded you of no one else. He was he was handsome and daring and you know he would say a long time ago he said Jeannie I I don't want to do any movies with a message I just want to entertain and then a few years later he said I don't want to do any movies without a message movies are too important we can change the world and we can change attitudes he really believed that there'll be grief but there'll be a lot of joy in remembering just how full of spirit he was I mean, the media's gonna be here for a while, so that's so that's a guy named Michael that tries to get into for me, so. Okay, cool. Yeah, thank if you, you need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah.